let's go ahead and get into it. So the shades I'm going to be using from the first palette is going to be Shuffle. And then at that top palette, I'm going to be using the shade Ginger, Yellow, and Sand. Um, and also Cocoa. So first, I'm just going to be taking the shade uh, Shuffle and placing that on my lid on top of the eyeshadow primer. Um, I'm just kind of pressing it in at first, and then I'm going to start blending the edges out. This is just like the first color, kind of like a transition color that I want to put. Um, and yeah, I'm just going to place that all over the lid and just like, you know, buff it in. Um, I like to start off with like, you know, a little bit of color and I like gradually add to my liking. And, you know, try to blend this to the eye shape that I want. You, you know I always blend like an around eye shape because um, of, of the brows. I don't want to, you know, mess up the brows, honey. But I'm just going to keep on blending that shuffle shade until I get it to, you know, my desire. Just doing some like you know padding and some initial wiper mo motions um, just to help blend out the eyeshadow placing it oh now I'm going to go ahead and with the shade ginger and I'm going to start buffing that onto the outer corner just to kind of deepen that a little bit it's been a while since I've done like you know these type of colors and I love it I used to wear these colors all the time because I feel like it really complimented my skin tone Oh yeah, I'm drinking celery juice. I was trying to be so healthy and that shit's so nasty. Ew. But I heard that it's really good for your gut health and for your skin and you know, just I'm trying to be, you know, a healthy bitch overall. You know, I'm trying to glow up on these hoes. So next I think I'm, I'm adding the shade Coco into the outer corner. I kind of just mix ginger and cocoa just to kind of deepen it up a little bit. And just doing the same thing I was doing, just kind of patting it in and then like kind of buffing the edges out. Now I'm going to take the shade yellow and sand and now I'm just going to buff out the edges of the eyeshadow look. Um, don't forget to set, like I'm, you know, I have to set, you know, the top of my brow bone. That way the color isn't as, you know, bam boom. It's a little bit more like, what's the word? It's kind of, it's going to give it more of a gradient effect. So I set that first with some setting powder and then I go in with my two shades that I mixed together which I said was yellow and sand and that's from like the uh, Stacey Marie Be Perfect palette. Um, which one is it? Ew, celery juice. Disgusting. But yeah, now I'm just going to take a big fluffy brush and just kind of buff out the edges. Um, continue blending in the eye shape that I want. We don't want to mess that up, but I did kind of lose a little bit of my cocoa and ginger. So I'm going to go back and deepen up the outer crease a little bit. Yes, ma'am. Got to have a little bit of depth in there. Okay, so just putting that all the way. I kind of took it a little bit into my inner corner just a little bit. Now I'm going to take whatever's left of my concealer brush. I didn't add any product to this. And I'm just going to pat it on top of my lid. Just to kind of make, create like a base for the gold shade. Like this is like my go-to look. When I just want something silly easy and hey you. So now I'm going to take the shade Fortune. Um, from that big Stacey Marie, Stacey Marie palette. And I'm going to just kind of tap that on. Um, and blend the edges out with that brush. It's really pretty gold. It's a pop and pop and pop and go. I didn't spray my brush at all. Like normally I spray my brush to get like, you know, the shimmers more popping, but like I didn't need to do all that. I just put it on top of the base and it's doing its thing, honey. So like I said, I'm just gonna pat it on um, and blend it out. I am going to add another pigment on top. You're gonna see in a second. <laughs> Ew, celery juice again. So yeah, now I'm going back in with the uh, ginger and cocoa shade. I kind of mix those two together and um, blending out the gold on top of the lid. Just kind of making sure that I like to see like if my um, gold is at the same, you know, if they're the same. Making sure everything's even pretty much. 
So I kind of want to blend a little bit more because the other eye is a little bit higher. Yeah, she's cute. Like I said, just gonna continue to blend the colors together. We like a seamless blend over here. I'm just continue to go back and forth and adding more of that gold shade. Now I'm going to add some more. I've been using this light pigment nonstop. It's the Brat Ink Spoil um, Pigment. I'm just adding that on top to make give, give it a little shimmy, 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 shimmy. I feel like the camera's not even getting it. Like it's like it's in person. It's just like bomb. Like it's just bomb. It's it's freaking bomb. You can kind of see a little shimmy, shimmy, but it does. It adds a little a bit more to the look for sure. I'm a bad bitch. I'm a, I'm a bad bitch. I'm a bad bitch. I'm a, I'm a bad bitch. No, y'all, like, lately, like, I don't understand why, like, my face be looking so, like, ashy. Because, like, in person, it looks fucking flawless. And I think it's because I don't have, like, a camera. I don't have a camera. I don't have a light, like, all around me. I just have a light directly on me. Like, I need a, a light, like, you know, above me and come on the side of me because, yeah. The way the lighting, is, my lighting is set up, it just needs to be a little bit better. Because in person, and she looks snatched. But sometimes, my you gonna see on the end, like I look a little, a little ghostly. Um, but um, now I'm just gonna take the shade, what's it called, Intuition, and I'm going to just kind of put that on a smudger brush and then blend it out a little bit. Just I want like a little bit of brown. Cause I do, I will put lashes on, and I do like to like have like a nice thin line. Or, you know, something where I put my lashes at to help hide the lash band, honey. And at first, like, I was going to put more in the inner corner, but I liked how, like, the shimmer kind of covered it a little bit. It was cute to me, so I just kind of kept it on the outer ports and just blended that and made sure it was nice and smoky. Smoky, oaky, oaky. And, y'all, I did record, like, me doing, like, my bottom... Um, eyeshadow, but yeah, I, it didn't come out right because the lashes that I wore were like way too like long in the way. <laughs> All right, y'all, this is the look right here. Mm, get into it, get into it, get into it. Thank you guys for watching all the way to the end. I really appreciate you. If you made it all the way to the end, well, since you already you already made it all the way to the end, what am I talking about? Go ahead and subscribe. Okay, hit subscribe. Oh, my nose ring. Like, comment, and share this video to your friends, to everybody. You know, be like, girl, look at this girl makeup. It's cute. Oh, <laughs> uh, yeah, y'all have a great day. I love you guys. Bye. <laughs>